Robin is made for teams, and once you've created your organization, you can invite coworkers to join you. There's a few ways to do this, and we'll cover that in this guide. First, if you'd like to skip the manual process of inviting coworkers, admins can enable single sign-on through Google, Office 365, or SAML from the integrations page. And if you need to whitelist a domain, just let us know. To manually invite users, admins will first want to navigate to Manage at the top navigation of the dashboard, click People on the left, then click Invite New Members. Next, you'll want to enter the email address for your invitees, and the name field is optional. Then you'll have the option to add folks without sending an email, or sending an email upon invitation. And if you choose to send an email invitation, that will look like this one here. And folks can click Accept Invite to begin using Robin. And if you'd like to upload a list of users in bulk, you can do so via CSV Upload. First, you'll want to create a name and email header in your CSV. These headers are case sensitive, so you'll want to make sure your headers are lowercase letters. And both the name and email header are required. Then you'll want to fill out the name and email fields. The name field here is optional as well. Then you'll want to save your invite list as a CSV file. Lastly, you'll want to navigate back to the Robin dashboard and then click Import a CSV file. Find the CSV file you just created and upload the new list of users. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to go to support.robinpower.com for more helpful tips.